Okay, it's uh, raining and drizzly outside today, so I'm going to work on. I'm going to work on the piston, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to make it in two pieces. I'm going to make just the piston and and then the rod, and I'll make that a press fit together. So I'm going to start with some half inch material, which I have in the spindle. Turn that down to 400 thou. First, I'll face off the end, all this garbage on the end of it that I have on the end. Uh, let's see if I can move you in closer. Move some stuff around underneath. If you can see that or not. Should be able to see it. All right. How much battery do I have left? Not much. All right. Well, just first thing we're gonna do is face off the end of that. I don't know what I was making. Something with hexagon. <laughs> down to uh, 400 <clears throat> it's a 400 OD it's got to slide into the cylinder so I'm gonna go ahead and get the cylinder over here take the cylinder head off here first it has to we'll have to slide into the cylinder so I'm gonna use that for uh, my checking device Go ahead. I'm gonna go fifty. We should have about 50 to go yet. Actually, it took 52, 52 off of it. I'm just going to double check this. I can't. I thought that I made it 400. I'm just going to quick check it with the calipers here. Yep. Yes, sir. 400 thou. So we'll take 20. We're going to take 40 thou off of it. I'm going to lay this somewhere where I don't drop it on the floor. A little pearl on there. High sulfur oil. Stinky oil. Actually, it looks like it rained. The rain quit outside, so I may uh, may not get this done. Eight thousands to go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and I'm gonna try to go nine <clears throat> to give it about a foul clearance in there. about a foul to a half a foul clearance. There'll be a Teflon, I'm going to put a Teflon uh, 
ring on it. Okay, so if that slides through there and that cylinder is 400, there will be three-quarter of a thou clearance. Let's see. That feels pretty sloppy. Hmm. Question is, now, do I use use it that way, or do I go ahead? Because there is going to be a Teflon ring, but that's. I think I'm going to go with it the way. It's 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 a little on the sloppy side, but the Teflon ring should seal it up. So we're going to go for it. So now I need to drill and uh, ream a uh, one-eighth hole in there. The rod <clears throat> that's going to be pressed in there is going to be an eighth inch. Get the center drill. Okay, I got something underneath my, I do have something, oh, I, <laughs> my center drill was chucked between two of the jaws laying down on the bottom. I'm going, it's, it's way on the outside here, and I'm going, whoa, that's way off center. <laughs> so I thought my tailstock had something underneath it or something. That's better. <laughs> uh. All right, so we want to drill it. I'm going to go with it. I'm going to leave a five thou ream. Yeah, I'm going to leave a 5 thou ream uh, material for reaming. I was up a little before 5 o'clock this morning and couldn't sleep, so I could have been out here a little earlier even. We went for a long walk. My uh, rowdy took me for a walk this morning. We are out walking. A dimension it was is missing so I'll have to calculate it. It is 170 plus plus a 30, right? No plus plus 60. So 130 plus 60 not 130. 170 plus 60 230 all right 230 thou deep minimum One, two, I got about Reamer Would be perfect. We'll find it. 
even a 124 would be okay. It would be a little tight, tight press. And a 126, 27. Not sure what that one is. I'll have to bike it. 126. One twenty five. Can't read this one. I think that one looks like it's one twenty four five. Let's see. Where's my mic? Yep, looks like a uh, 124.5 right here. I should grind a notch in it or mark it somehow. Let's see, I'll take a stone. That way, that way the next time I'm looking I can just go right to it. I'm just going to take a stone the shank a little bit here. That way, when I see that, well, not showing up very well, but I, I do see a little stone mark there, so, <clears throat> so the next time I'm looking, I can find it quick. And the ring groove is 60, 60 thou wide. I've got a 50 thou part off tool here. That might work. Cutting that Teflon ring will be a, a trick. To get it to, it's going to be awful thin. Should have made it bigger. Well, I could. And just leave the two lands on the outside a little smaller. Okay, this is 50 thou. All right, it's when you're in touch and get my zero. Right there. And then fifty. Now I'm going eighty five from the edge, and I'm trying to decide whether I want to go a little less than that and leave that like well eighty would give me ten thou. It would give me a 70 thou. I think that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to go 80 thou and then plunge in. Then I'm going to move over my uh, 10 thou. I don't know. Boy, that's going to. I'll have to really be careful with that tool. I'll have to sharpen it and went pretty slow. Otherwise, it's just going to flex away unless I get a grind up one. 
and we'll try this first. So we'll go 80 thou, 50, and the 80. That's the land on one side. And we gotta go in 100 thou from when we touch. <laughs> Oh my God! Get some oil. Pretty slow. So it's 60. I'm going to back out. I'm going to drop the tool just a tad. Time into it. Just trying to make sure that it's a straight wall in there. All right. I think I'll take a stone and stone that a little bit. the edge too much. Now I'm gonna switch I'm gonna switch tools. I'm gonna go to a thicker part off blade. This blade's a 92. And then 230, I think I said. 60, 85, and 85. Yep, 230. All right. One, two, and 30. Right there. All right. Harder off, hopefully.
Okay, so there's the piston with the marks in the end. That it's not going to hurt. That groove, little groove that I did with the. And let's check that to make sure I got the right width. 230, right on the money. And this should be 80. And this should be 80. Okay, so now I need to make a little little tiny Teflon ring. I'll have to sit down and calculate what what the diameter is going to be with my slitting saw going through.